7 onto your PSP system. First, you're going to have to have 5.00 M33 already installed onto your PSP system in order to use this. And if you don't have 5.00 M33, go to the link in my video description and click on it and it's going to tell you how to get 5.00 M33 onto your PSP. Anyways, you're going to first click the link in my description. It's called IR Shell. It's the IR Shell version 4.7 link. After clicking on that link, you're going to find a website that looks pretty much like this. Okay, you're going to scroll down and you're going to find the download. notes if you want to know how to use your IR shell applications you have in it then these are the ones you, you click on these and they'll show you how to use them um, basically the IR shell is sort of like an iPod but not as I have an iPod phone but not as complicated like you can put applications on it and stuff anyway This file is a pretty big one, so we're just going to wait. And we're just going to wait. And we're just going to wait. And wait. And wait. And wait. And finally. PSP and IR shell both dragged into your PSP file. After dragging those two files inside of your onto your PSP, you're gonna okay. Here's the complicated part. If on the root of your PSP you do have the SE plugin file already, you're gonna click on it, and then you're gonna go click on this text file. Seven. 
that's on your PSP. Go to the text file and just copy and paste those words from the four point from the four point seven R shell folder SE plugins folder from the text file and copy it into that text file. Sounds complicated, it's not. Okay. Thank you. You now have IR shell onto your PSP. If you have any questions, please contact me. I will be making